this is one of my all-time favorite decks. I, I would consider it one of my uh, best decks. So basically it hovers around the fact that we use Jack and uh, his close quarter range to sneak around and uh, get some kills right off the bat while they're distracted with the rest of the team while they're attacking. That's why I have three attackers. And uh, basically Jack hits hard. He's a really hard hitting character. He, um, uh, when he's up close, he could technically one shot a bunch of characters just with his auto attack, let alone that he has a grenade. So sometimes you could get two kills with, with him within a short time. Uh, it's pretty good. When Jack goes down, I, I obviously, I, I go to Baron. He resurrects, he has an ultimate that resurrects, so I'll just use that. Resurrect your Jack, continue on. You could more or less like three, four shot at a tower, you could you could end the game. But yeah, let's uh, go through my, my one minute win and I'll explain while it's happening. So right off the bat, you're going to want to switch to your Jack after you set where the attack is going to be. You could go with the bottom way or the left or even the right, uh, but it's always good to just follow a certain person, even going into battle, right? You see them attacking your other characters, you just want to go from behind and you want to take them out. Once you get to the tower, you, you hit so hard, you get two, three shots, move to the next one. At this point, if your team's still alive, they can do a lot of damage. You can start heading up to the top. And that's it. That's how you win the game in less than uh, 60 seconds. It obviously can't go that well every single game. So when things go wrong, you can switch to your jet. And she's pretty good for movability, so she could get anywhere really quick with her jetpack. Um, and it's just something you should just go straight for the last tower, jetpack yourself up, shoot while you're up there, then just rinse and repeat. And at that point, you should be that far, that much farther ahead than the other player. That um, you can literally just sit back with Jack defensively and uh, kill everyone who attacks. <laughs>
Then Frag decides to match me up with this guy. He's about 2,000 trophies above me. He's on a 31 uh, battle win streak. And uh, basically, this is my 25th game. If I would have won this, I would have had a 25 win streak. But instead, uh, well, I'll let you watch. <laughs> I figured everything was going to hell, I was going to lose, just keep attacking. And then Jack gets a kill, and I had a chance. And here, instead of getting that kill and finishing off the, the tower, I decided to pass it up and uh, I got killed. Instead of me going to one of the characters that are farther ahead attacking some some of the other enemies uh, I was pissed off so I just decided to stay as the healer and when I did move you know if I got uh, if I had done that earlier I probably would have won the game so yeah my streak ended at 24 but uh, this deck alone got me all the trophies I needed to it's been one week that I've been playing and I've got over 5,000 trophies uh, it, with this deck alone um, I would say it's one of the best decks I hope you guys liked that video uh, like I said I really like this deck it really works for me um, if you guys want please join sticky flames uh, we're, we're pretty active we donate as much as we can be sure to subscribe and like the video to be entered in this month's giveaway for a $100 Amazon gift card and be sure to comment I subscribed after